Hi, welcome to my channel. I am not happy at all. And I'm going to go straight to the point. This video is for the chairman of Arisco Foods. Please share this video until it gets to him. And it's about Chioma, the pregnant woman that bought his tomatoes and said that there is um, so much sugar in it. But before I continue, let me play this video. I, I have people that want to leave to leave. If you want to die, I help you to die, finish. I wish. Wants to be free. Wow, say you heard the man. He say if I, if you want to leave, I will help you to leave. If you want to buy, if he help you to. That is the chairman of Erisco Food, the man that arrested chairman for making a review about his tomato. First of all, this man, you be big man. If not be sent to Nigeria with day, this statement where you make, they supposed get one or two things where they supposed do you. Because I really make a statement, a statement like this on national TV. You understand? I mean, it's a, something that you can defend, but it doesn't make sense. I you heard him. That was the chairman of Risk of Foods. Such statement shouldn't come from you. You can't say that in UK. You know, sometimes you can be right, but through your actions, you become wrong. Let me make it clear to you that Chioma is within her right. It is called customer right. Chioma did not do anything wrong. It's unfortunate that in Nigeria, you guys don't practice negative feedback. What you practice is only positive feedback. Let me show you this this is napolina tomatoes this is plum plum tomatoes okay napolina peeled plum tomatoes it's got sugar in it let me also show you tomato puree It also has sugar in it. In case you don't know, tomato is a food. So many foods has sugar in them. When we make tea, if we like, we add sugar. When we make coffee, if we like, we add sugar. I use sugar in cooking, you know, certain things. Your tomatoes is not a bad tomato. That she doesn't like sugar in her tomatoes doesn't make it a bad tomatoes. And like I said earlier, so many tomatoes have sugar in them. Almost anything tomato you buy, read it. I'm not sure she's been reading the labels, you know, the ingredients in the tomatoes she's been buying otherwise she would have known that she's within her right and this is so unfortunate that it's happening in nigeria where people have no right to express themselves the poor has no say in nigeria that's wrong a man in your position should not say those things that you said I've also watched where you said you'd rather die than to let your man get away with it. Please, your life is important as well. You are more important than your company. You also said that your company is older than your man. Can you see all the points I'm making? Why would, because your man said something that is within her right, cause such problem? Because... Nigeria is a country where the rich bullies the poor. 
The poor has no say. Anything they say, they can't say it if it is true. They can only say yes to anything the rich says. That's wrong. Here we have positive feedback and negative feedback. What is positive feedback? When you're praising a product, when you say you like it, when you say it's very good, when you say all the good things that product does, and a lot of people will say it, you would then see some people that will say, I don't like the product. That is negative feedback. Okay? You will see somebody that will say, I don't like it. They will name all the things that are not good. In fact, the way they will rubbish that product. Somebody may think it's personal. No, it's not. They are expressing themselves. And having given a product negative feedback will not stop people who like that product from buying it. I have done negative reviews on some products. Go to my channel. My channel is called Queen Akbaka Beauty Channel. It is called customer right. If you buy something and you're not happy about it, you can express yourself. For you to say that there is a place for a woman that is pregnant in prison, come on, it's tomatoes. She did not kill anybody. And let me tell you something. Anybody who stops buying your product because of what Yoma said, has already been looking for a way to not buy your product. They label cigarette that it will cause cancer, it will kill you, disease, this, that. People are still smoking. I'm not going to, because of what your mother said now, not buy your tomatoes. The last time I, you know, I visited Nigeria, they used your tomatoes to cook for me and I loved it. Your products are wonderful. I don't think you understand that customers do have right to express how they feel about your product. She did not do anything wrong. So I am begging you. I'm not telling you what to do. I want you to end this case. Choma is pregnant. And let me remind you again that you are picking on the wrong woman. You know why? Because she's pregnant. The whole world will intervene if care is not taken in this case. When one person cook for the public, the public will finish their food. But when the public cook for one person, that person cannot finish it. Please, don't let it escalate. That Choma is poor doesn't mean that she doesn't have a voice. And if she doesn't have a voice, that's where we come in. Voice for the voiceless. I am a woman. I'm also a mom. Seeing Choma crying hurts me. I feel bad because she didn't do anything wrong. It's her right. In an ideal world, your company is supposed to contact her and say to her, if you're not happy with the tomatoes, bring it to Sanso office. You refund her her money. Unfortunately, that doesn't happen in Nigeria. Let me give you an example. I went to Sainsbury's. I have three food stores that I love so much in UK. Sainsbury's. Max and Spencer, Waitrose. Let me give you an honorable mention. I do shop in Iceland for their frozen items. Okay, the frozen food, they are good at that. Now, I went to Sainsbury's and I bought apple pie. But when I got home, inside the apple pie was cherry. Instead of cherry, instead of apple inside the pie, it was cherry inside it. So I drove back to Sainsbury's and I said, I want to see the manager. The manager came, I said, here, I bought apple pie. But when I opened it, I saw cherry. The first thing that manager said was, we're sorry, madam, that um, the pie you bought has cherry inside because in Sainsbury, they do have cherry pie and they also do have apple pie. But it happens to be that they labeled the cherry one with the apple one. Can you see? So the, the apple pie, they labeled cherry on the other one and labeled the apple, the, the apple pie. Let me explain it well. The cherry pie, 
because since we have cherry pie and the apple pie, instead of putting the label of cherry on the cherry pie, they accidentally put the label of um, apple on the cherry pie. You see? So what did he do? He apologized. And let me surprise you now. This is how things are done. You know, all Africans speak is the wrong thing that they do. They don't pick the good things that white people do. I've never seen people so reasonable and understanding like white people. Yes, I said it. Okay? He gave me another apple pie and then refunded me and also gave me a token of goodwill. Let me repeat that. The manager asked one of the staffs to go to that aisle and change it, bring me another apple pie, the one that has apple is inside it, gave me back the money for that apple pie, and then gave me token of goodwill. Sainsbury is one of my favorite food stores. I love Sainsbury's. Can you see how this case ended? I was happy. They were happy. Why did he do that? I'm not the only customer that comes there, but they want that customer relationship. Okay? They don't want me to stop coming to the store. They knew that the mistake was coming from them. Now, the only way, doesn't mean says they can't sue you if you wrong them. There is something you will say about them that is not true. They will sue you to come and prove it. Okay? In this case, Chioma did not lie. Most tomatoes, thin tomato, plum or puree, they do have sugar in them. It is not your fault either. There is nothing wrong with tomato, sugar being inside tomato plum. Because tomato is a fruit. The chances of sugar being in it will be there. So if she doesn't like tomatoes that has sugar in it, all you have to do is say, I'm sorry, madam, that um, you don't like it because it's got sugar. Um, do you want a refund? Nobody will die because they ate your tomatoes that has got sugar in it. Most tomatoes have sugar in it. That's what I'm saying. I'm on your side in a way. And in most cases, I'm not on your side at all. I am on Choma's side in certain things. Where I am on your side is where, you know, you are not happy that you think that what she said can damage your reputation or, you, you, you know, the, the things that you sell. But it's not supposed to. That's why we have negative feedback and positive feedback. And also, that's why we have customer rights. I'm also going to give you another example. I did a negative review for a hair company. I said that their customer service is bad. Today, I model and review their hair. I am the only person that models and reviews their hair. Can you see? From giving them negative feedback, I am now the one who models their hair. They understand very well that whatever made me say that, there was reason. And they were able to resolve it. They have one of the best hairs in the world. Yes, Chennai Hair Factory. They have fantastic, beautiful hair. And when I did that review, I never condemned the hair. The hair is very, very good. Till today, it's one of my favorite hair. Do you understand? So allow people, people should have the freedom to give their you know, feedback when they buy any product in Nigeria, not just your, not just your product. People can't shut up. Okay, what if actually something was wrong? So by force, they must eat it, they must buy it. That's wrong. You have beautiful products. When I visited Nigeria, they used your tomatoes to cook for me and I loved it. I'm not against sugar, depends on the quantity. There is no way the quantity of sugar in that tomato can be too much as, you know, exaggerated. Okay, so I understand that part where you're upset, but that's not enough to say she will go to jail or give you seven million. No, I disagree. And also, for a man with such a wonderful reputation, I see you as a decent man. I see you as a rich man. How can you say that you'd rather die 
than to see her free. No, your life is what more than your company. Okay, and let me tell you something, chairman of, is it what do you call it, Erisco Foods? If money is all you have, then you're poor. In life, we have to have humanity in us. We have to have compassion. We have to have conscience. We have to have the fear of God in us. We have to think when we're making decisions. We have to put ourselves in somebody else's position. If it is me, will I like it? You can't tell me that if that was your daughter, somebody wants to gel her because she said there's sugar uh, in uh, tomatoes. Uh, that will, I think that she used the word of buy. I don't know what that means, but from what they explain, it's like killing. Of course, they talk anyhow. All of them are very, um, almost 80% of people in Nigeria are very insensitive, in case you don't know. I saw it in one newspaper some time ago. Nigerians, 80% of them are very, very insensitive. They talk anyhow. Before you talk, think of how you would feel if that was you. So I am begging you. I am not telling you what to do. I am begging. Tamper justice with mercy. You picked on the wrong woman. You know why? Because she's pregnant. Nobody will support you. You can't use Joma to set an example this time because she's pregnant. Anybody who boycotts your product because of what Joma said, have you been looking for a way not to buy your product? You don't sell bad products. Do you understand? That's not an excuse for somebody not to buy your product. It's unfortunate that, you know, people are not allowed to say the truth. Anytime you say a company's product is bad, they come for the person. They say you want to spoil their market or they paid you to damage their reputation. No, that's not true. People have freedom, you know, to express themselves when it comes to products that they buy from you. It is called customer right. And that saying that there's a place for women that are pregnant, you know, if somebody wants to die, you help them die. If they want to leave, it, it didn't even sound good coming out from you. I'm telling you, things like this can only happen in Nigeria. Somebody in your position, 24-7, must control their statement. Watch what they say. I'm an influencer. I do reviews. I watch what I say. You see, in you people's mentality, some people, I, I wouldn't say it's you, but a lot of people, mainly black people, they think public figure is when you're rich. No. Once you're doing anything that the public is watching, you are a public figure. You must respect yourself. You must control your statement. You must watch what you say. Do you understand? I can't say anything anyhow. I don't talk anyhow. And I pick particular topic to discuss. Watch my channel very well. I've discussed more bad. That's it. Until this came. I don't just see things happening online, and I talk about it, no. I pick something that is important, something I know that through my voice, a life can be saved. I believe that by the grace of God, my video will touch your heart for you to forgive Chioma. Please, Chioma, did not say anything wrong. It's unfortunate how you people interpret things. And remember, people only do what they know. When they know better, they do better. Although there are people, even when they know better, they refuse to do better. It's not good to be wicked. May no one cry in my name. Do you understand? May I never be the reason for anybody to go to bed crying, hurting. That's not nice. You are a rich man, you have it all. Your products are wonderful. I am here to tell you that I have, you know, eaten your tomatoes and I loved it when I ate it. Okay? Also, let me use this medium to say to you, the chairman of Erisco Foods, when I visit Nigeria, I will review your tomatoes. If you like, you can send it to me. You can DM me, tell your rep, your salespeople to... DM me on Queen Akbaka Beauty Channel. I will give you a beautiful review. Your tomatoes are not bad. You have good products. Chioma is within her right. I want you to know this. And to hear that the police arrested her for speaking her mind. Come on now. The things that are important that the police should go and, you know, people who are doing horrible things that they should go and arrest, they, you, they, they did not. 
This is a way of shutting poor people up not to speak up when something is not right. That's not fair. Please, she is pregnant. I am begging you. I am not telling you what to do. I want you to tamper justice with mercy. And I want you on your own. Speak this particular lines that I'm going to say now. While I cannot condone what she's done, I don't think it is appropriate to punish her. You're going to feel good. The world will love you more if you let your mother go. Can I shock you? This could be a test from God to you. People will hate you if you put that girl away. I know out of anger you said you'd rather die. You understand? No, you will not die. You will leave. That's your company you have worked hard for. You're going to live as long as the almighty God allows you to. Nothing will happen to you. Because we say things out of anger that we don't mean. And many things we say out of anger, we also mean it. But this one, you said it out of anger. And you want to use Chioma to set an example. But it is at the wrong time. Do you understand? Sometimes you say to somebody, if not because of this, I would have done that. So say that to Chioma. Okay, people will love you more when you let her go. We all know that you have the power, you have the capacity. And because you have that capacity to put her away and you don't, that makes you a good man. Do you know what power is? Power is nothing if you can control it. Control is everything. Believe me, if you forgive Chioma, you are going to benefit what you have not benefited before. People are, your tomatoes are good. Every tomato has sugar in it is what I'm trying to say. Maybe there could be few that has no sugar in them. This is Napolina, one of the best brands. I don't eat nonsense. Look, okay, it's got sugar in it. This is tomato puree from Sainsbury's. Sainsbury's do not sell nonsense. Everybody knows that. These shops that I mentioned, Sainsbury's, Waitrose, Max and Spencer, they are, they are high end. Okay? So before something makes it to their shop, it's been checked out. And I'm telling you, I am not asking, I'm not advising, I'm telling you now that many tomato plums and puris have sugar in them. She just didn't know that. And she's within her right. It's just unfortunate that in Nigeria, you said the truth you die. That's not fair. Please. They should stop shutting poor people up not to say the truth. It's wrong. I beg you. This video is for you. I will do review for you when I visit. If you like, you can send it over to me. I can also review it here in London. Your tomatoes are very, very good. You have one of the best tomatoes out there. So disregard what you have said. If I can say that your tomatoes, they are good. Come on. I don't eat nonsense. Looking at me, you will know that my health is very, very important to me. So I beg you, nobody will boycott your product. Nigerians talk anyhow, unfortunately. You should know this. You live there. You are a good man from what I'm seeing. I know out of anger, you said things that you don't mean. Especially, you rather die. Please, you're not going to die. Please, you've worked hard for your company. So stay alive. Let Chioma be. She is pregnant. If you don't accept this, my plea, even your heart will not be happy with you because if that was your daughter, you wouldn't like it. In your heart, you want to let her go, but you want to set her, you know, use her as an example. So please, 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 tamper justice with mercy. If you don't, you won't be happy. You know you're doing the wrong thing here if you put her away. The money you're mentioning, Choma hasn't got it. I'm sure you know it's impossible. So indirectly, you're saying she must go to jail. No, that's not going to happen. It's not nice. People will speak on her behalf. The world are watching. So show that you're a good man. God bless you. Chairman of Erisco Foods. God bless you. Please forgive Chioma. Let her go. Thank you all for watching. In case you've not subscribed, please do. Follow me on my Instagram on Queen Akbaka Beauty Channel. TikTok Queen Akbaka. Snapchat Queen Akbaka. Bye.